Hey everyone, it's Hoochie from Nagios. In this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to use Auto Discovery in Nagios XI. The Auto Discovery feature in XI comprises two components, Auto Discovery Jobs and the Auto Discovery Configuration Wizard. Auto Discovery Jobs automatically scan your network environment to identify new hosts and devices using ping and nmap. The Auto Discovery Configuration Wizard then allows you to leverage the findings of an Auto Discovery job to start monitoring the newly discovered hosts and devices. This feature streamlines network monitoring by saving time on device discovery and ensuring comprehensive coverage through automation. And with that said, let's get into it. Open up XI and navigate to Configure, then under Configuration Tools, click on Auto Discovery. Here you can create new discovery jobs. Click on the New Discovery Job button to bring you to the setup page. For the scan target, enter an IP address and net mask of your choice. If there are any IPs you want excluded, you can enter them here. You can set the schedule for this job to run one time, daily, weekly, or monthly. OS detection can be on or off. Scan delay can be set if needed, especially for large networks or to avoid overwhelming network resources. If you want to specify any custom ports, that can be done here. Once you're finished, click on Submit to create and run the job. After a few minutes, the job will finish. Under the Actions column, you can edit, rerun, view the results, and delete the job. Once the job is finished, under Devices Found, you'll see the amount of newly discovered devices and the total number of devices found in the targeted IP range. To configure any of these discovered devices for monitoring with the Auto Discovery Wizard, click on New Devices to bring yourself to the Configuration page, or you can find the Auto Discovery Wizard on the Configuration Wizards page. Start by selecting a job you want to use to choose new hosts and services to monitor. Here you have the option to show all hosts that were found during the scan or only new hosts that are not currently being monitored. Default Services selects the type of services that you like to have selected by default. There are Common, None, or All. You can choose the type of address that you'd prefer to use for the newly created hosts. You can choose IP addresses or DNS names. On this page, you can select the hosts and services that you want to monitor. The host name can be also changed here. After selecting the host and services you want monitored, click Next. I'm going to finish with the default settings, but if you'd like to adjust some more settings, such as notifications and defining which groups the host and services belong to, click Next. You should then see all your host and services you selected to monitor go live after a while. And there you go. That's how you use the auto discovery feature in Nagios XI. Hopefully you've enjoyed this video, and if you did, make sure you leave a like and subscribe. For any questions or assistance, visit support.nagios.com. And until next time, take care and keep monitoring.